Hello everyone, it's Duck 2, welcome to another mod overview, this time on Glalands. I wanted to play it in a new dimension, uh, you make the portal with warped nether blocks, uh, it's pretty much just still being worked on, and uh, there is a handful of tools and armor and some other blocks that make up the dimension. Uh, you will need an igniter though, which is just some blaze powder and an inactive one, which you then make with a knife and uh, some iron and get some nuggets. And, uh, yeah, a warped nether, uh, sorry, warped, warped, warped portal, I mean, there. I know what I meant. Um, right, so, uh, first up it seems like we've got glar matter, which is apparently able to be used for tools and armor immediately, that's interesting. At least I'm pretty sure that is. Yeah, just immediately, alright. Um, alright, so I'm just going to get a pick and see if we can actually mine it. We get it by your fist or something? No? Because I was assuming it would make up most of the uh, dimension and not be used for anything else, but apparently it can be used. Unless you need silk touches or something? Nope, diamond or high it seems, alright. Uh, we'll try it. Oh, it actually, is pretty powerful, so makes sense. Uh, also got some glug goop, which I assume is just a water equivalent of sorts. Um, the fluid in the dimension. We'll cover the armor until soon. We've got goak wood, which obviously is your wood option here. You got plank sticks and a few other things, gate and so on. Let's just cheat these in and get a good look at what they are like. And we'll move on to some of the other stuff soon. So we got obviously the log. Oh sorry, that's the log. This is the, the multi-sided one. That's the yeah, the wood one. That's the log. That's the multi-sided. Planks, leaves, stairs, and so on. Leaves, I assume, actually drop the block, not the um Sapling. Uh, we've got some berries, which we'll take a look at soon. It's a bush, which I assume you can just break and give it to you. Yep. Uh, seems to get probably two there. The igniter. We've got some soil, which apparently you can smelt the grass. So I'm assuming you'll find this in certain biomes. That's what those look like. Uh, we've got some bricks, which you can make with some brick items or Glum matter if you have access to however much of it and you want to build with it. Uh, we've got some ores we'll get into. There's a block of that material, of course, which you can obviously make tools and armor from. But I guess if you want the actual decorative form of it or storage form of it, you do have that as an option. Uh, we've got some shrooms, which you can use for stew and a salad. Along with the berries, uh, we'll get to some of that stuff soon. So the stew we'll cheat in, we'll cheat salad in. We've got this, which is just another ore gem thing, which you can obviously also make into tools and armor. And then we've got some grass, copper ore, and then that's the other fluid. And the grass is just like so. So that'll be on the surface ocean. So that's those. We'll just explore the dimension a bit and see what happens. Uh, it seems to be... this is kind of like soul sand and walking on it as well, so that's interesting. Um, so we've got, I assume, the... Let's use them. Well, the copper, sorry. Um, right, so I'm just going to check. I'm assuming this is all diamond capable. Nope, okay, so that can be mined with a wooden... Uh, sorry, iron pick. Not a wooden one. Not a stone one. Yep, mostly seems like you need iron or higher for the copper one there. And it's pretty crowded, so we'll go into Spectator and see what there is. I don't have a map, so oh well. Um, we've got... that's crude oil from Voluminous Energy, that doesn't need to be covered. Um, so we've got some lava in here, apparently. I don't think that's the actual fluid in there. You've got the mushrooms in a few of these. 
This mostly just seems to be a cave biome of sorts. Got some flowers apparently generating here, which I don't think they're supposed to be able to generate in this dimension, I don't think. Got something like cornflowers or something. No, okay, so they can generate on this stuff. Alright. So, what have we got here? Um, so, granolite. I'm actually going to get a ton of these ores just to test what ores we need, uh, what pick we need for them. Let's do this. Alright. Yep. So I assume we can use the actual picks from the mod to also test out what, what it would use on these. So let's see. That one can't, that one can, that one we know can. So the glass steel. Nothing there. Granulite alloy. And the copper. So it seems you need that material, which is itself, which can also break that. Granulite alloy. Okay, I'm not sure if the progression's a bit broken there, because I don't think you can technically do anything with it. Because the copper you can easily break, but this is an upgrade. Actually, no, that's just the material itself. Yes, okay, so that's just what they call the tools. So granulite can break itself and it can't break that. That can break both. The copper can't break any of those. At least as far as I can tell with the following there. But then the steel, which is glass matter, can't break them either. We'll see. Yeah, not sure about that. It can easily break that, and the cop can break itself. But I don't think any of these can. I think that's a bit unclear. But anyway, um, besides that, we'll get rid of these and uh, see what the armor and tools are such capable of. We'll go to the food first, though. We're doing that. Effects here. There's no mobs or anything. I don't think yet. So nothing to cover there get to the food and then we'll cheat in all this armor and tools and see what they're capable of besides the obvious of the tears. It's got the berries, which I assume you just get from the bushes, which wherever you find those I'm not too sure. Maybe it's in a different area. Um, so that just gives one there. Mushroom. Obviously has to be combined. Um, we've got the stew, just the combination of things, which gives you two and a half there. And you've got the salad, which uh, gives you seven. So yeah, if you have access to some shrooms and berries, you can do that. Or if you just have access to two mushrooms, you can do that. So yeah. Um, right, so let's see.